It is finally here, College Football 25. As you can see on the screen, I'm getting ready to boot this up and I want you to go on the journey with me. We're gonna take a look at the main menu, see what it looks like compared to NCAA 14, go into the different settings, take a look at the roster, and then go into play now and kind of get a feel for the game. And this is to help those who can't put their hands on the game yet, can't get their hands on the game yet. Uh, and have to wait until Friday. This hopefully helps you get a better feel because I know there's videos all over YouTube. Uh, but I want to start this from here, as you can see on the main screen, all the way up to play now, and then we'll take it from there. I'm so excited for this. I've been waiting so long. We all have. We all have. And there's the intro. EA Sports. I'll try not to talk over uh, if there's like the intro and all that. And here it is. Loading it up, guys. We are here at the main menu, and it's a little bit of a different look. Well, actually, not a little bit. It's a big difference from what NCAA 14 looked like. You have the uh, transitions between the different settings up at the top. So here you got home, you got play now, ultimate team, road to the college football playoff, and dynasty. But you know this is the setting that we'll be going to. Uh, we got the play now. Just quick play, you got the career, and then you got the online options here. And you got the mini games, and then you have to create and share, settings, and more. So let's go into the settings first. Start small, work our way up. So here you have the game options for setting. You got the favorite team, you got the offensive playbook, even teams. I'm gonna put this at Heisman actually. Get it and uh, an idea of how difficult the di most difficult uh, skill level feels like. We're gonna leave this at five minutes. Got the play, play clock, accel accelerated clock, and then okay, so it says coin toss here. So I wonder if they'll actually do a coin toss in the game, uh, but it looks like from this setting, it might not even do it. Uh, and then you have the kicking, and they have different options tap and hold, tap and tap. Wear and tear, I'm gonna keep down on of course. And this is interesting, they have different passing types. So you have revamp passing, placement passing, and it explains all the different ones to the side there. You can get an idea, a rundown of what each one is like. I know they've been advertising this one the most, they've been discussing this one the most in the deep dive, so I'm gonna stick with this one. Passing slowdown. Choose the amount of slowdown during a pass, not enabled during online play. I'm just gonna leave that as it is, off. And I'm not gonna mess with any of this too much, I'm just gonna leave it as it is. But there's a lot of settings, and we're just in the first option, which is game options. So let's take a look at the next one, I know it's cut off right there, sorry about that. So you have injuries, fatigue, and player speed, parity scout. So this is at 50. And then this is really low, so we'll see how this actually plays out once we start, you know, getting into dynasty mode and go to glory. Let's see what happens there. So you have the crossplay settings, just one quick setting. You have accessibility, uh, and then you have the penalties. Won't touch that. So this is interesting. You have offensive pass interference on on and off. I know it used to be a setting. But this time they just have it on on and off, and you have an illegible receiver downfield, running the kicker, running into the kicker. So these are all actually on and offs now. They're not even sliders. You got the player skill all at 50/50. You have visual feedback. Again, not gonna touch much of this, but just to kind of give you a look at what it looks like. And if you're paying attention to the uh, background, the, the menu music. It's, it's really quick, quick pace compared to what 14 had. Menu narration option is set to off. So they have menu narration, menu narration as you can hear. I have that on. Help those. Menu narration need option it. is set to off. And then you have volume control. Rosters. Here we go. So manage players. Go back to see if they show all teams. There it is. And if you saw their top 100 players on their site, on the College Football 25 site, you'll see that they already already released this. And you have Will Johnson at the top, Michigan, Ali Gordon, Will Campbell, you got Starks on there, 
and so on and so forth. But you know, it kind of gives you the idea. No 99 overall players, as most of us already know. Highest one is 96. Let's see who the fastest guy is. Nick Harbour from South Carolina. Wide receiver. He's 6'5", 242. He's a big dude. 99 overall speed. That's going to be interesting. Whoever's using South Carolina in the dynasties. And then you have Pleasance, cornerback for Oregon. And the only two 99 overall speeds. And then you have a bunch of 98s. Won't go through all of them. Uh, let's see. Just for the fun you got Williams at 99 strength Zachariah Branch at 98 agility and let's just see who has the highest trucking Taj Brooks from Texas Tech and then you have uh, Hampton from North Carolina and as you can see if you look at their weighted matches their trucking stat so change it oh they have changed the direction here which is actually different from agility here so you have change of direction, that's a new uh, attribute that I hadn't seen before. And if you look at the players, at the players, you'll see the, their physical skill set and their mental skill set. So for white, you have fan favorite, winning time, best friend, mental, recoup, cutter, and double dip. That's physical traits. And they ha he has the highest, uh, well, he's tied for the highest, and then you have these four guys here who have the highest change of direction that's interesting ball carry vision let's just go through let's see spin move I want to go into catching McMillan Burden Travis Hunter there he is 95 overall you can see he has five physical abilities right there let's go into so okay this is this is really interesting they actually went in even more separating between, uh, where is it? You have short run route, uh, route run, you have medium route run. If you look at the top, you'll see it labeled there. So Presley has the highest short route run, medium route run goes to McMillan, and then Royals gets the highest deep route run. Catching traffic, you know, we've seen that before, spectacular catch. Let's just go through this. Let's see. Who do you guys predict has the strongest arm in college football? That goes to Austin Mack, Alabama. Cole, DJ, Milro, 96. He has a strong arm. Anybody who watches Alabama pretty much knows that. I would assume. Uh, then you have short throw accuracy, medium throw accuracy, deep throw accuracy. They might have this in Madden. I haven't played the latest Madden to be honest. I haven't played it since 22. They might even split up the short run, the medium route run, and deep. They might do that. I'm not sure, but it's interesting and it's actually exciting to, to know that it's actually in here as well. You have to throw on the run, throw under pressure. They have a throw under pressure, breaking sack ability. That's that's actually a very interesting one. We'll see how this plays out. But Milro has the highest right there at 97. They have Green at uh, 95, and then you have play action. All right, so then you got man covers. Who has that? Will Johnson, and then Morrison has pretty much tied for his own coverage. But man, Will Johnson, that's he's gonna be a beast in this game. And look at his physical abilities. Knockout, ball hawk, jammer, house call, blanket coverage. Man, Michigan's defense can be very, very fun to play with. Got pass block on here. Pass block power. Pass block finesse. It's for lineman, right? Return, stamina, injury, toughness. Okay, so pretty much ended the typical way. But it's, it's nice. It's fun. It's, it's exciting to see the new attribute stone in here so I'm, I'm really excited for that and then what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pick a player for now so I know a lot of us are wondering how much can we edit a player because I know that was a topic of conversation how much can you edit a player so let's go into Milro and see what we can do here so only one option there edit player so you can see I can't touch anything it's all just grayed out none of this is editable ratings you can't touch their ratings either. You can't do anything here. If you want to give him a stronger arm, uh, better agility, whatever it is for players, you can't. You can't. Uh, 
and then attributes again um, you can't touch any of this you can't touch any of this let's go into apparel so it just starts off like this so it's a whole sub menu actually if you click into it all right so look if you go into edit apparel you got all these sections headgear torso arms lower body and feet so let's go into headgear so there's no switching from if you remember from 14 it just say the helmet name and then you would click left and right to choose the different types this just lays it out for you and then there's a warning sign here cannot equip helmet model with current face mask so Let's just mess with this and see really what it does. So these are all the different helmet types. And there are 16 different types. 16. So we'll go with... Let's go with... This one. Yeah, just to mess with it. And it has a warning sign, so I want to see what that really is about. So we'll select it. Alright, so this is actually... Kind of weird. It changes the... Helmet depending on the face mask that you choose. So, what I assume this means is that you either choose the helmet and you go from, you know, you, you go from there or you just go straight to face mask and pick the one you want because it changes the helmet anyway. So, I don't know, I think this could, could have been done a little bit better. You know, it could have been done a little better. Sorry, it's just zoomed out right there. But, you know, you can see all the different helmet types. These are, these look great. I mean, compared to the options we had in 14, if you don't play Madden, like I said, you only play 14, you wish you had all these different options. So it stayed with the helmet that I originally chose. And then these are different types of visors. So you have clear, dark, Oakley clear, just a few options. So I'll go through Oakley smoke, prism, dark, and smoke. And then you have the mouthpieces. So that's... It's something. It's something. It's nice to have that option. I don't know if I'll be using it. Personally, sorry, I keep going back and forth there. And then last but not least, we have the face paint. And let's see. We have 10 different options here. You can go back. And then there's torso. And look at all these different options, guys. So this is kind of fun. I know a lot of people will be going with this option just to mess around with it. Can I equip Jersey style with the current black jacket? Uh, and that's on. There it is. Right, he has that on. If I turn it off, that's what it looks like. The shoulder pads, you got the different sizes, right? All the way from small to extra large. The neck pad, oh, this is this is nice. So you have different, oh, look at this, guys. Different styles, look at that. Look at that. The vintage neck roll and the single roll. I know whoever's making linebackers, they're going to be using these. I'm going to be using these. If I'm using a linebacker, I have the flag jacket. Oh, that was the back plate. Sorry, the earlier setting was the back plate. This is a flag jacket. And Milro, I don't know if he was originally wearing one or not, where I messed with the setting. Oh, yeah. Okay. So you have undershirt. This is where you can show a compression t-shirt or a sleeveless hoodie. Uh, and then you have the arms. So what they did is each tab is a different body part rather than going down like in 14, selecting from left and right, just previews it. This is this is good. I like this, how they preview everything before you even, uh, you even choose it. And they have the, uh, the arm tape and they have it in different colors, guys. They have it in different colors. So it, it goes secondary color and then you have team color. So it's going to uh, you, you get to choose your team colors basically, which is I think it's awesome. It's awesome, and you can choose if you want one arm or both arms to have it. You have different options here, right? Go to the wrist, right? Pretty, pretty basic, pretty standard. But I like how they separated, you know, everything uh, in a tab menu uh, because it's easier to go back and forth. In my opinion, in my opinion, it was a little bit of a Pain sometimes with 14 how things would work the different gloves that they have here this is kind of cool I'm not gonna save any of this of course we'll leave Milro as he was so let's see base layer socks uh, you got the pants let's see what the options of the pants are so you have okay just drops a little bit but no uh, standard and then above knee or below knee basically uh, over knee and then you have the towel oh let's look at these settings right back the side 
you know, this, this is good. It's, it's fun. Oh. <laughs> Alright, so you got the hand warmer. Alright, just one option. And position. So you can pick the hand warmer and then you get to put it behind him or in front of him. Thighs. What options are there with thighs? Oh, the padding. Okay. I'm assuming. Uh, knee pad. Alright, this should easily be visible. Alright, you have the standard and then you have... Yeah, so it just makes them a little bit more chunkier looking. And then you have the knee braces. And then you can just put this on one leg or the other. Alright? So that's it for that. And then you have the feet. So we go with the shoe model, the Sakai, and then we'll get to the later options. Left pad, right pad, see exactly what that is. But it looks like we have a lot of shoe options here, guys. Well, fair amount, fair amount. Okay? They're pretty much all Nike. Yeah, it's all Nike. So the sock height. So that's it for apparel. So you guys got to see. I'm gonna exit out of this. And like I said, you can't change any of this, but I do want to see uh, what the QB throwing styles look like. Uh, when it comes time for me to create what's a because I assume that's when you can mess with these settings. And continue without saving, of course. Don't want to mess that up. And then you can see they have update. You can update rosters as the season goes along. I'm assuming they're going to update them. It's a big task. I mean, 134 teams, 85 players per team. So it's going to be a lot of work, but I hope they get it done. So I'm going to go into play now. And let me see if there is a random team. Okay. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to play as Alabama, actually. And then here you can actually separate between the conferences. So, and, you know, instead of shuffling through the teams, this is way easier. So if I want to go into SEC, there you go, Alabama. Uh, actually, I want to play as Alabama, but home. I mean, away. And I want to play as Texas A&M because they were given the number they were given the number one uh, toughest places to play ranking. So I want to see what it actually feels like. So there we go, Texas A&M, Alabama, and just right off the bat, I like the graphics. You got the signs at the bottom. You have the overalls. You have these little lines over the helmets. I mean, it gives a nice, nice feel, right? Nice, good, good job on the graphics uh, so far. I like it. So. Alabama 92 overall, a lot of us know this already, and uh, Texas A&M 88 overall. So, and you can see the difference between the offense and defense. Uh, so, we're gonna go with Alabama. I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna touch anything. I'm just gonna keep it as it is, and just move forward. All right, ready? And it's gonna go to this. So, exhibition, Peach Bowl. You can do quick presentation. Uh, national championship, the bull games, lots of options, lots of options. So we're gonna go with, uh, I don't know what quick presentation is, but I'm gonna go with exhibition, the big game team, right? So there's two options, and on the right there, it will show you the crew for each of them. Uh, we're not gonna even teams, we're gonna leave the quarter line to accelerate the clock, uh, leave all of this, and the time, I'm gonna choose nighttime, and then I'm gonna leave the weather clear. I'll leave the weather clear, see what that looks like, right? And when you're ready to go, simply advance to the game. All right, and I'll be quiet here so we can see the intro for Texas A&M. Welcome to Kyle Field, home of the Texas A&M Aggies, a unique <laughs> and special environment in college football. This crowd coming together to make up the 12th man, trying to make it very difficult for any opponent. And Ryan, we have a fun one here ahead. A top Love 10 team walking into the snake pit of an environment just trying to get out alive. This will be fun. As we'll see the number six team in the country, the Alabama Crimson Tide, taking on the 24th ranked team, the Texas A&M Aggies. For EA Sports College Football, I'm Chris Fowler, joined here in the booth by Kirk Herbstreit. Kirk, let's get to the action on the field. Graphics. <laughs> All right, here it is. All right, so thoughts on what the... Oh, we'll go back to that screen. We'll, 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 we'll go back to that screen. Sorry, I can't talk. I'm excited. I'm too excited. <laughs> All right, so we're going to get the 
kick. And he takes this one back. Alright. About to 15. Alright, so now let's take a look at the so place like Oh look at this. So they show the overalls there. I know my face is covering the stats over there. We're showing the different stats. So these look at these player, formation, concept, play type, personnel. They have all sorts of options. We're gonna stick with coach suggestions. So let's just go with the 45 kick base. And look at the stadium pulse. We're looking at a freak out there today. There it is. Take the first snap. It's Miller. Oh, I like that. That looked good. That looked good. Oh, look, the players are getting into it. Why don't people want to talk about the spread? This looks fantastic. And then you have the impact player ratings up there. Showing uh, the center stats right there. Sophomore Arizona showing the stats there. This looks good. Let's go with the RPO alert bubble. Toughest rank right there at one. And I'm assuming, of course, that this is going to change as the season goes along. Makes a quick grab. Alright, we got the first down, we got the first down. And they're showing another one right there. Nick Scorton, right? And then these are their previous plays. So it's showing the previous plays right there. And then there's also recent plays uh, down there. And you can also have a favorite player section on there as well. Look at this. And then it's showing the different uh, player stats and abilities for each of your players. Look at this. This is just. <laughs> This is fun, guys. I so far I'm I'm impressed. I'm impressed. I know we still got the gameplay here. We got five seconds. Early, All right. He did ran up to the line. Snap it! Snap it! Snap it! He wasn't here. snapping it, guys. For the today. All right. They brought him down. So if you can't hear it, it sounds fantastic. Oh look, rusher matchup. Look at that, guys. They're showing the difference between Miller and Moss and showing who has the edge over there. And then previous play again, right? Oh man. So they're showing different screens, different screens. Okay, so now let's do what kind of play should we run here? Let's do uh play action cross, right? Second down after Ten that seconds. One the previous play. Oh it looks like Milrose uh <laughs> I think he kept on the arm braces even though I didn't save it. Fakes so here's a play action. Oh he didn't throw it and we took we take a sack with their team. So it looks like they kept the changes that I made to Milrow. Uh, I'm going to try to change that back. That should not have happened. That should not have happened. I want Milrow to look all strange. So third and 13. It's loud. It's loud, guys. It's loud. And it's showing. I didn't even select this play. It's like messing up. We're going to throw it on third and very long. He's going for a big play now. Oh, he caught it. Oh, 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 oh. I just was throwing it, and you might have seen the uh, the the throw bar. Key pass defenders. There's Jackson. Oh, look, it's showing the replay. I love this. It's showing the replay while you're choosing your place. Love it. Love it. Uh Well, let's see. Let's see. So number nine. I'm just trying to take a look at what he was doing there. Or number seven. Looks like he lost the ball. Yeah, it looks like he lost the ball. I'll take it. I'll take it. Alabama getting set for the first All right. and ten now. Ten seconds. I like the walk up to the line of scrimmage. All right. I can't see nothing, man. I don't know who I'm throwing it to throw. here. It's Milro. Oh, it's come on, come on, come on, come on. Touchdown, Alabama. Now right, let's see a touchdown celebration. So I swiped the right stick down. Well, that start could not That's what that is. So I'm also looking at the lighting here and, see what, and what the nighttime games look like and it looks good, it looks good. Look at that. The, and the stadium goes quiet after I scored a touchdown. Uh, yeah, I really got to change Milrow's uh, uh, uniform, change it back to what he was originally. I don't know what happened there. I said continue without saving, so... All right, so now we're going to do the pass attempt. So here is our first attempt at the field goal. You got it moving left and right. So you're supposed to hold it. So stop and then let go right before he kicks it. Oh, well, as the bar is going up, you're supposed to let go at that time. All right, so six plays, 
3 minutes, 13 seconds, 87 yards. That was a huge fourth down conversion. Or third down conversion, sorry. Oh, so it's a little bit to the right. I like this. It makes the game more challenging. Yeah, he got that all the way back there. All right, now let's play defense. The models look good. The player models look good. There's this. Showing the matchup to watch. You saw that? I know my face is in the way there, but I also, I also like the, the scorecard at the bottom. It's good. I like that. It's not at the top. This is, this is weird. I think Madden does that. Oh, nearly picked off, deflected. Right, so let's do. Let's put some pressure on him. Let's see what he does when we are. Let's use. Tampa simple. Oh no, let's do hot blitz three. All right, let's do hot blitz three. I want to see what happens. So Defense auto flipped. I think you can turn that off. Right? Should be able to turn that off. Pre snap motion from the receiver. All right. And remember, I'm playing on Heisman. Tackled behind the line. It's a third and two. All right. Actually, on third down, I'm just going to let's see. Overload blitz. Let's just bring everybody in. I want to see what he does. I want to see if he. Oh, oh, they got the first down. Freed up the linebacker to get into the backfield, and the result is a tackle for a loss for the backer. What a clutch play yeah. here by this we'll take it. I want to see this. I want to hear the stadium the if they're if, if they uh, somehow get a. Oh, there's a flag. There's a flag. Live, they got a new set Already downs, first flag of the game. To dig into this lead. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Yeah, we're accepting that one. Oh, look at the fans. They're pissed off. <laughs> so, all right. I apologize. See, apologize. I know I've been good. talking. I'm so Overcome excited, but. The rest of the drive, I'm going to try to keep the chatter to a minimum so we can hear Fowler and Herb Street uh, talk. Defense moving receivers commentate. around now before the snap. Off the play fake, looking to throw on first down. With the catch, it's green. And he'll get the first down yards before they finally bring him down. This is why running the football is so important. You run the ball and you don't play action. It affects the eyes of the safeties and linebackers and frees up some space for the tight end to be able to pick up a nice game. This Texas A&M offense is moving quickly down the field. Ball handed off. He's dug down, but the game. And I wonder why I'm so quiet. It's because I was chatting so much. I want to hear the commentary now. It just keeps you on schedule, leading to more manageable third down situations. Never underestimate the value of control. Oh, we got a pick! We got a pick! All right. All right. Let's see a celebration. How about the big 300-pound defensive lineman getting his paw on that football and bringing it in for an interception? I don't know if he's supposed to be holding the football there or if he was just holding his hand to his chest. Marcus Fox, 85. Look at that. The quarterback moving around in the pocket. Oh, good. Look at the fans showing disappointment. I love that they're showing more shots of the fans. Onto the field. Actually, this let's go last possession. Let's see RPO. If this can make adjustments and prevent that this time. So let's see. First down play call yeah. coming up. How aggressive yeah. will it be? They'll hand it off. Black throws to head up. So the new, the new uh, uh, mechanic here is that you have to hold it now for the quarterback to keep it. You have to hold the button. So if I, so here's my read on the right. So I held it. Just want to show. But I was supposed to hand it off. To the I just to see if it would work. Should have let it go, man. So that's ha that's the first quarter. But you gotta get that ball out quicker to not allow that defensive end to make that play. I can't wait to see what halftime looks like to be honest. The flipped ends of the field. We're ready now for the second period. So we got no choice but try to get that first down. I'm gonna do it guys, corner strike. A big play here. We live and die by corner strike. To convert here on third down. Look at that man. It's all over the place. I mean we get the idea, but uh, of what the play should look like. But here we go, ready? Oh, look at that! He threw it, it was way off target, and the meter, ah, oh, I couldn't get it right in time. I couldn't get it right. 
screen. We didn't take advantage of the effect, so let's see. Look at that. I'm trying to move the thing around, and it's shaking like crazy, man. And I, oh, oh. It's a good kick still at right at the 20. Let's see. Bringing it back, it's Barber. And the returner is tackled by this Sideline looks uh, more full. I just hope that it looks more realistic than we had before. We you know, had like those kind of like weird looking models. Look at that. Look at the sideline. Look how alive it is. Oh, did you see? Let's see what they can do here. The ref putting the ball down and then walking over to the side. Look at throwing here to start the drive. And it's incomplete. The defender nice. The same nice. The and now it's second down. I like the animation so, so far. I just gotta see. See, look. I saw the ref. He put the ball down. But give the defense all the and you have the ref. Oh, he caught that one. He caught that one. I like that. The way he just rolled over because of the momentum. I'm assuming that's why he did it. That middle linebacker seemed to just run past it. I'm not sure what exactly happened there. We'll have to look at the replay. Scanning the field. It's Weigman. You see how the, the ball carrier just tried to stay in bounds? Oh, pretty. About what makes this receiver so special? Oh, we kept referring to his route running. Here's an example of that. Great. Route. Again, I enough separation. I'm, I don't play Madden, so. We go with the ground game man. Running back takes the hand up. Now look, see the the ref is now running over to the right side. And then making a tackle. Offense just couldn't get enough of a push to get any yards at all. And that run produces a decent game. Let's see. Moss has 20, 20 yards on five carries. And it shows the longest run. The entire first half and really making them one dimensional. And if that doesn't change, I don't know how they get back into this game. Oh, blown coverage! Woo! Nails on downs! Look at the stadium rocking, man. I gotta see the replay for that. And the receiver runs a route like this. Good luck trying to stop it. So maybe this is a great start for this combination of this quarterback and receiver. So let's go into into uh, instant instant replay. So here it is. Oh, he just straight up beat him. Look at the motion, man. I like that. I like that. So hold on. So what exactly happened here? So. He's lined up, right? Put it on Thomas. He's lined up, gets by him, and dang, he just just straight up beat beat was that down? Who's that down? Brown, Brown, sorry, Brown straight up beat Brown off the line. No help over the top. Look at that. Look, it sounds good. In this drive, a little more urgency. Finance now clustered. Look at the players, they're looking at him. Call a timeout, <laughs> had to call a timeout. It sounds so nice, guys. The sound, fantastic. All right, and the player, that, that was, that was nice, man. They're looking over at him. See, they're looking at him to see if he's changing the play. That's so sick, man. All right. So we're gonna go off the back and I'm gonna go for the tight end. Alright. And he finds a wide open receiver. They forgot about him down I like him staying uh, on his feet. He goes out of bounds, going out of bounds. Move the sticks more than enough for a first down. You know, Chris, you right. think about it, efficiency has always kind of been the description of a look, great Alabama. Got solid play art because that was a big game. The playmakers that they've had composure is a thing. Go, 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 go! Oh man, they caught him! They caught him! They got him! The defender did not fight on the oh. take at all. All right, all right. Let's see. All right. The offense will look to regroup here at second. Now, I'm just messing around. I'm not playing seriously, guys. I'm the winner. I can't. This is not the play I selected. So I guess we'll find out once the play starts what it is. The throw. It's Milrow. Looking right, this one caught. Oh, I thought I could make something of it, man. After the catch, the defense all over in that time. 
Man, the defense was all over that play. Just left him almost no Under stats. So I was ball. hoping to see if they would show the uh, wear and tear. Thought it would be here. I don't see it, though. Anyways, we need a first down, guys. We need a first down. Why not go with shot wide wheel? It's loud. It is loud. And it gets worse the more you wait. Here's the snap. Quarterback looking to throw. Oh, go, 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 Law, go, Law. Let's see what the celebration looks like. There it is. <laughs> Chris, as you know, anytime you hit a big post route like this for a touchdown, the timing between the quarterback and this is that Heisman is essential. Nice job of not waiting too long. And that would have happened to too hitch, between Texas A&M and Alabama, early, Alabama, to be and honest. Allows his receiver to run underneath the beautifully thrown football for the touchdown. Yeah, time to throw. Nice, beautiful. And I like how he just looks to the side, look at the players. I mean, assume that I haven't played Madden again. Assume I have not played Madden before. All right, so let's go for the kick. Kicking and that got now for the stadium run. quiet. Oh, oh, if you hold it too long, it starts shaking. Because I reached the very tip. You have to let go of it right in time. Right in time. Now the kickoff team is out on the field. So look, I'll try it again, ready to see what happens if I hold it too long. Oh, when, oh it starts back at the bottom. So then it ends up, be, ends up being a short kick. Inside the 15-yard line, bringing it out. All right, yeah, they're pumping up the stadium. Man, the sounds, I can't say it enough. It sounds fantastic, guys. Okay, let's see if uh, our coverage breaks down again. Let's see if they can do it again. Oh, I like that. I like the way that looks. I like the way that looks. Looks so good, guys. Let's go so far. Oh, they got him. And, a running game. and we'll call a timeout. Let's see if we can get a touchdown. I might sim the third quarter, to be honest, and just play a little bit of the fourth. Just to kind of speed this up a little bit, you know what I mean? Scanning the field. It's All right, so it's a split. Oh, oh, I almost had that. Oh, I almost had that, guys. Look at that. How about the call here? They go with the screen on and third down and short. You don't see that call very often. They're not able to even complete the pass. So That's right, no Kirk. chance at a conversion. So we That's got fourth right. and short. Two minutes. Two minute drill, guys. away here. We've reached the two minute warning. Yeah, to see if the offense can build on this lead before the break. So six first downs. I got about two minutes more of possession time. About 50 more yards of 50 more total yardage right there, right? So let's see if we can get a touchdown and quiet this crowd down. The number the one toughness rank. Oh, look, they're not that loud right now. They're not that loud right now. Can they keep clicking here? I'm gonna, I'm gonna run with him. I'm gonna run with him. Oh, let's see what he does. Oh, he's fast, guys. He's fast. He is fast. I'm gonna go with the uh, slip screen. Let's see if we can catch them off guard. Look at that. No squiggly lines. Let's go. They've got everybody covered. Oh, oh man. Oh, I couldn't get off in time. Could not catch them off guard, fellas. Could not catch them off guard. I'm just going with coach suggestions, and I'll uh, do a little bit more formation later. I'm just trying to keep this quick. Let's go flanker dig. Completion makes it second down. And the stadium's getting louder, so I'm assuming third down is going to be insane. Quarterback drops back from the shotgun. Oh, he couldn't hold on to it. For a flag, doesn't get it. Brings up third down. There, there it is. Easy here, backed up a long way to go for a first. Oh my God, guys, look at that. I mean, jeez. All right, let's see. Let's see if maybe I can get it. Drops to throw. Right in his face. The quarterback did all he could here to wait until the last. Hold the mill roll back, guys. I'm making. I'm playing with him as a pocket passer, and that's what it is. Actually hit him as he throws the ball. Let's see. That incompletion. The offense will. Matt, the, the kick, the kicking game is no joke, guys. I'm telling you. I mean, I, I only had to kick uh, an extra point, but I want to see what it's like kicking. An actual field goal. But the punting with the stadium moving around, and that thing is flying all over the place. 
physical defending. That one falls pick. incomplete. Pick. Brings up second down. You get a tight end like this, and you know he's used to dishing out the punishment, but here, he's the one that has to absorb the contact. Get him. As a result, oh, he stayed on his feet. Oh, he jumped he over me. All right, and there it is. Let's go up. So I don't about you were talking about disguising coverages. So I gotta need some, some, some time to look into that. Oh man, that, that looked good. I'm not gonna lie, that looked good. The defense is spread all over the field, creating some one-on-one matchups. I gotta, I gotta see. I gotta mess with that later. See what, see what setting that is. Been a decent gain there for the defense brings him down. Call a timeout. The timeout is called a touchdown. Looks clean. Look at that shot. Game here as we approach halftime. You got the rolled up jersey right there. We have to have big plays to be successful. It's a nice solid gain here. Keeps you on I'm liking the cutscene. I'm liking what I see so far. All right. So where's the wear and tear? Can we see the wear? Oh, I was a little late there. Makes the first down on this drag route. The quarterback does a nice job of being patient. Right, waiting oh, for that oh, oh. To open up in that zone. And put it right on the money for the receiver to have a Did chance you get the first down? Catch it. Yeah, yeah, we'll overload. Every play important down here in the red zone. Here's oh, the oh, snap. Oh. Offense looking to throw See, the ball. See, I had the... Uh, Can you get in? Did you get it? Set of bounds, but a nice gain there. And the offense will oh, yeah, it was out of bounds. Oh no, he does. He does. Okay, okay, okay. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh, he throws it away. That was good. Smart. Smart AI. He throws it away. I like that. He waited too. He waited. Alright, it's gonna be running right up the middle. And they're trying to punch it in. And they got it. Muscles across the goal line. Touchdown, Texas AM. Alright, it's tied. Boy, how exciting has this first half been? We get a touchdown here. They're it's it's, it's going to be this game up. tied. A great so the toughness rank means something, I guess, right? But they're both ranked. They're both ranked. Maybe on Moss. Player customization, the visuals. I mean, the gameplay so far, in my opinion, is solid. After it's down. solid. So, can I score in 28 seconds, guys? I don't know. Let's see. Should I just play uh, crazy and wild? Let's do... Let's just make them run a fade. And look at the player. See, you saw that? The uh, Bernard on the left responded to my uh, play call. Oh, that's just... Oh, and it's picked off. It was tipped and then picked off, man. And he paid the price. Oh, he's pulled the spin move on me! <laughs> oh man, the standing was going wild. Guys, of course, I'm just doing this for your presentation. I threw that pick on purpose, of course. I mean, why not? It was tipped. I, I have to. I, I have to go into replay to see that. So, just to get an idea, look at the look at the snap. I like the way the snap, right, right into his. Extending his right hand, blocking the blocking. I mean, it looks solid. It looks solid to me. There, there. He had just enough time to get rid of it. Throws it, right? Look at, look at that, guys. Come on, twenty-five. Just beautiful. Come on, man. How can you not like that? Look at the way he's running. And then he pulls a spin move on. Oh, he, Milrow. The, <laughs> he pulled a spin move on Milrow. Oh, my God. That, I got to see that again. That was just beautiful, man. That, that, look at this. He just jumps with both hands. At five, though, let's see. I mean, what can you judge here, right? Bernard, you see the ball. Look at that. They're all looking, right? One's not looking. But 25, 20, they're looking, right? And then, oh, you got to see better effort from Bernard there, man. You got to see better, better effort. I wonder if that goes into the deep route, the whole spectacular catch thing. I wonder if it goes into that. But I want to see, maybe because he's moving full speed, or maybe he didn't see 25 there, and he thought he could just extend out. But that that's a gorgeous play, man. I like that. I like that. And look, and he's running with momentum. Well, kind of, right? He gets picked off, and then he kind of had to slow down. And then one over here, I know I'm going back and forth, sorry. But here, this guy, right? 
who is this law yeah right I guess he didn't know what happened I mean look it tipped off and then all of a sudden <laughs> the defender has it right I, that looked good guys that looked good man uh, that looked good. All right, can we prevent them from Here scoring and taking the lead for half? I don't know. Thirty seconds of the half. Here comes a first down pass right, attempt. Let's see. Let's see. This is the playing on Heisman, right? It's Muhammad. Ooh. They finally tackle him at the four. It's a solid pitching catch. Heisman, man. Heisman. I'm playing on Heisman, so you can't not fool around, man. Can't. The field in the final seconds of the half. Chance for just a couple more plays. Oh, so out of reach. The end zone, but it's incomplete. Anytime you're snapping the ball, look at the quarterback just looking line, over to the sideline. For the quarterback, the windows are tighter and they close much right, let's faster. Go cover three. He's got to do a better job. I know I shouldn't, but quicker to give his receiver a chance. Maybe I shouldn't. I like the way that looks, by the way. Looks good. Looks good. I like that. The visual, the visuals. Oh, beat him. Into the end zone. Look at that. That animation was. I like that. Position and that didn't take long at all. Well, that's how you take advantage of an opportunity. Your defense sets you up in great field position. Maybe this is what really You're happened. For field goal. You're looking for a touchdown. touchdown. Give the credit to this offense, but look at that. And punching it Throws in. it and he slides down. Oh man, that's. I don't know. I, I don't know if Madden has that, but that just that looks fantastic. Now here's halftime. So. And that will do it for the first half here. Kevin Connors now has our halftime update. Gentlemen, what else is new? A really raucous environment there in College Station. Each of these two offenses has looked like well-oiled machines, but it doesn't take a genius to figure out these two passing attacks have run circles around these defenses. Man or zone, nothing seems to be working, and I'm not sure that defensive coordinator is going to be able to figure things out here at halftime. It's time to throw it back to our guys in the booth to start up the second half. All right, Kevin, thank you. It was all right. Day. It was all right. But this is what I want to do next. I want to go into the pause menu and kind of view the options here, right? So you got, uh, let's see, does this work? Let's see if view highlights work. Yes, yeah, so you can take a look at the play. So this, this, this is good. This is fun, right? We have that. And then we have Super Sim, we have stats. Again, you know, I'll dive more into this later, but I just want to kind of show that. And then look, I wanted to show this too, the, the uh, celebrations, right? So we go into celebrations and it's basically like the right stick and then all the different uh, 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 right trigger, left trigger, uh, L1, L1, L2, R1, R2 mixed with the how you uh, move the right stick. Right, that's basically what the combinations come down to, right? And then there's also so there's touchdown ones, and then there's first downs, and then there's interceptions, right? So the basic is it. I like this. I like the way they did it. Um, you just uh, flick the stick in any direction, and then just press a button. I mean, you know, you can memorize what's what. Uh, striking a pose. I don't know if the Heisman. I don't think they can use that word. I think that's what it is. I don't think they can use uh, the Heisman. But look at this. Salute or show the eyes, Colorado only. <laughs> I should have used them to see what that looked like. So it's the right stick to the left combined with R1. So they make it pretty easy, but I like that. So I was using this one, right, jacked up. And then I did the, uh, I don't know what the other one was. Might have been touch them up, I'm not sure. But this, I got to see. This, I got to see. Um, strapped, why are you throwing my way? I like this. I like this, right? And then you have coaching. And look, this is this is cool. It keeps it the sub menu in within the same screen, which I like because it's better than going back and forth between the screens. I like this so much more, right? So you got depth chart, injury, the audibles, right? Controls. Oh, this so this goes into a different uh, different screen. Obviously, it has to, right? So you can mess with that, and then you have the options, right? You have the options. Uh, right accessibility all the other stuff so that's all there so i want to go into let's see what abilities are right so this is just a rundown of all the abilities name the type and then it has four different levels right four different tiers bronze silver gold platinum and then it gets better as they go and also they say it doesn't guarantee the ability but it gives it a higher chance of that happening right 
And like I said, if you want to know more about this, go into their deep dive on their uh, uh, on their blog. It goes in depth and it's good, does a good job of explaining everything, what's going on, right? So um, these are all there, right? What I wanted to see was wear and tear, and I have a feeling they don't show it uh, for play now. Uh, I think that's something maybe they show in Dynasty, Dynasty mode. Uh, it's something that's shown there. And also, if you look at the pause menu, I we skipped over this, but you can see uh, the score, the score, and then the breakdown by quarter, and then how much time is left in the quarter. We're going to sim the third quarter, right? Uh, let's see what the options sh uh, show here. So let's see, play options, what's this? Play key moments, play full game, play all offense, play all defense. So they have that there. That's, that's, a, that's a great addition, actually, I like that. If you wanna just play offense, just play defense, I like that, uh, that's there. Play key moments. And then you have jump ahead, which is, you know, next quarter, end of game, change of possession. And then also, wow, look at this, guys. Every play by quarter. I'm assuming, right? That's a, it would be, yeah, every play by quarter. Yep. It's, it's deep so far. I like it. But let's do, um, let's do, actually, let's do play key moments, right? So it's, uh... Big third down, make the stop. Uh, let's do, let's skip it, let's skip it. Let's go to the next one, right? Your defense needs your help. Let's get tough and keep them from the end zone. So they're about to score, actually. Uh, so let's see if we can stop it. Let's see if we can stop it. On the set. So they're at the 15, all right? And they're up by a touchdown already. So it's going to let's keep going. Well, until you stop it, right? I haven't been able to stop them, so like I said, guys, I'm messing around here. I mean, I like to play the game more seriously, more competitively. I fall all sorts of plays with subs and all that stuff. And he scores. Nope. Push there a little bit. Ball's going through his thigh. All right, come on. This guy's just having one of those days we'll take it. dream about <laughs> against the secondary. Let's also give credit to the wide receivers doing a nice job. I can job overlook that if they're and the big fellas hopefully to fix it, right? Giving him enough time to throw. Yeah, totally got beat there. So, all right, so continue. So let's go to end of quarter, right? Let's go to next quarter. Maybe Alabama will catch up for us. Right. Jump ahead to actually let's do let's do let's do play key moments. Let's test myself. Let's see if we can get this. Oh, they scored. Five point game. Red zone alert, take advantage of the field position and get some points. So we'll play. Let's see if we can get a touchdown. Right, fellas? Let's see if we can get a touchdown. So it's first and goal. Alright. Stadium post surprisingly is not high right now. So I, I assume those guys not raving their arms is Alabama. Here's the handoff, one first and goal. And touchdown, Crimson Tide. So let's see we what kind of celebration he does. In the fourth quarter. Oh, just a great <laughs> job. Football. Loud. It's loud. Daylight. Couldn't find anywhere to go there on the keeper on the option. Again, that's great assignment football by the defense. The sure hands. It's long. Completion gains about Should we go six for it? Yards. It's a fourth down call. Should we go for it? I'm going for it. It's a meaningless game. I'm going for it. On the field to go for this one, needing to get a first down. Let's see if he gets it. Let's see if he gets it. Oh, 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 we didn't get it. Moment missed. That's not the outcome we hope for. Let's move on. Let's see if they score a touchdown. Your defense needs your help. Uh, let's see, let's see. It's just not a smart decision in my let's opinion see. here to go for it on fourth down. And Chris, I know we're so three points would tie the game. <laughs> and, and when to go for and I've been terrible. I'm in score on me. By nature, but the oh, yes, we got the sack. You got the sack. All right. Well, Come on now. Oh, look. As the you can see their, uh, the did not their arm seems really dirty action. from the... You saw that. They're like, their jerseys are getting dirty and everything. That's sick, man. Look at them. All right, I I have to I have to go into the same replay. 
right? You look at them. Look at that, guys. They're, like, getting roughed up. So that's that's a great detail, man. Like I said, I don't know if Madden has that, but my, that, this is huge for me. All right, I know. Who was it? I, I think it was on Alabama. Somebody. Sorry, it's a defense. Shouldn't be bunched. Up. Maybe they should be bunched up like that. But here, number uh, zero. Who is this? Lawson, right? The blur effect is a little bit annoying to get around. Uh, right? But here it is, right? And look, his he's not wearing it. And, and it's just like over his elbow. Like you can see the, the, the stains right there. I wonder if the helmets are like scratched up. I, it, it looks like they are, man. I can't, I, but I, it's so hard to tell, man. But it's little details, and so far they've killed it. With the Three. And Sack sets up second down. To the air, it's Weidman. Yes. He'll be taken down. Got him. Got him. A really good job by this defense. The quarterback looks to the stadium are beautiful. Look at the to find his open receiver, but before he knew it, he's on his back. Look at I just that that was that looked pretty sick, man. That looked pretty sick. The transitions, the logos, the replays, man. I, I like the way this looks. Now it's third down and long. And the quarterback drops back looking for an open man. You got it. So now catch to the tight end. So I'm gonna call time really out. Tight coverage here by this to drain the clock. Now they give up the pass underneath. But here's a kick. Do a nice job of rallying to the football to keep him short. See how easily he makes marker. this. He's home. Now we've got a decision here on fourth down. Oh no! He ran into the kicker, man. There's a flag down. It was on the defense. Wouldn't be enough for first time. Figure they'll take the three points. Stadium. How did you do that? Man? I I I didn't do that. Special teams offense coming back on the field. You can't make contact with a kicker like that. That would sound very very natural. We got it. Always hurts. Five after the completion. Defense getting pushed back. Looks like a man is down on the field after the last play. So we'll take a timeout. Here comes a crucial second down play. Every yard tough to find down here in the red zone. All right, second three. We had that stop, man. Using the ground game here. Tailback has the handoff. Right, the junior able to bring him down quickly. Weird spin uh, mechanics go. going on, animation going on. The goal line. They can still get clean that up. Down without scoring. Oh, it's a screen. Oh, I should have seen that coming, man. It's complete to the running back. They stop him just short. The defense really backed up now. It's first and goal. The Aggies will line up now. It's first and goal. Ah, I should have seen that coming. I had control to regroup a bit. Read it really late. Now a chance to take the lead with a touchdown here. It's first and goal. Guys, and it might win this. You have to have hope. And he got it. Did you see how that play broke down? Interesting. I like that. I like that. And he struck the height in close. This offense, Chris. They put themselves in a position to put a touchdown on the board. And they take the lead. And now we'll see. I got to have to take a look at this. Just the way it looked, man. Look at this. Like, it's just fantastic, man. So he gets the ball, right? It's a pitch. And look, eight is there. He sees him. And he just cuts inside, man. And and then 19 just gets him. But hold on, what's 80? 80, 80, all right, so we got to call it out, right? 80, I don't know what you're doing. I don't know if you just kind of like outran or out, I don't know what the word is here, but you went too far out to block because 8 just cut in. Uh, 8 for Alabama. And then uh, you're lucky that 70 was blocking for him because then he was able to cut in. But I like this, man. I like the way he cuts in and then 19 get his hand on him. And he doesn't bring him down. He just, like, breaks loose. And, and look at the momentum from 19. Ready? Look at this. See? I like that. 80, 80 has to block there. I, like I said, I think he just kind of ran too fast. And then just look at that. But it could have been, like I said, could have been on 80. Could have been on, uh, sorry, uh, eight on Bama to see that and just kind of cut in. Look at that, man. And then he just gets crushed by, uh, look, not crushed, but runs in. He can't do anything. He just, he can't get him. <laughs> I, I like that, guys. I don't, I like, I, I don't know what to say. I like that. I mean, I know 
the only thing you can say about this is this. He's looking right at him, and he was just lucky that this guy was there to block for him. Reed Adams, right? But I liked the way that, that play looked. That was good. That was good. All right. It comes down to this. They need a touchdown. They've got some time to yeah, work Yeah, is shaking like How crazy, man. How aggressive will they be? Who makes the grab? Enough for a first down at the 37. Well, I'll tell you what. This guy's been able to put the ball in some tight spots all game long. And here we are late in the game. He needs to continue to play with that consistency. That's a great example that he's up okay, to. Yeah, we got to run. Not run. much after the catch, but it is good enough for a first down. Where are the, where are the plays? Where are the plays? Come on, come on, come on. To throw. It's Milrow. Pressure is coming. He's going to take off. All right, 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 and we're out of bounds. Heads out of bounds after running for the first down to keep right. this scoring threat alive. Yeah, I really got to get him so back to his normal uh, gear. Big chunk play, right. this offense. I know I'm Not going to deep, route, deep plays, but... Oh, makes the grab. You got it. Runner scoops out it. of bounds after gaining decent yards. And here the tight end shows off That's his hands for a nice I'm game. gonna go with the screen. See the big man okay. his touches. And still and here not, comes the noise. This is just, yeah, they're, they're, they're not quieting down this the at all. To make a big red zone stop. Running back grabs it on the screen. The tackle is made, but there's a flag on the field. Let's see what that's about. Welcome the passer. Personal foul. Welcome to pass. Welcome to passer. Heck, Ouch, yeah. All right, so let's see. You cannot make All right, so in 14 throw. slants, they were friends. really making some noise now, trying to help out this defense to get this stop near the goal line. Looking to the end. Oh, ho, ho, picked off. He throws it right into double. No. Oh. <laughs> the stadium's well, wild. Down, that's a great return after the pick. That was stupid. That was stupid. And he's hurt. That was stupid, I admit. I saw the coverage there and I threw it in anyway. Hey, don't judge me. It's just for fun. And begin the celebration. Chris, this has been an unbelievable game and this is really all about do it. And then just skips to the end. Maybe throw the wristbands to the crowd for the kids. It was a good game. Loves, good game. Good game. Fun. Get to Fun. share it with the home team and the fans. It's a great win for this team. But they put a lot of points on the board, Kirk. The offense Honor. really clicking today, but wow. it just wasn't Lit us enough. Up, man. Yeah, you gotta understand that this defense has certainly played better. Hey, Nick Saban's gone. One of the most talented offenses, in my opinion, in the entire country. Obviously, there's plenty to improve on, but you also have to acknowledge that so the offense highlights. was just really good. And that is going to wrap it up. We enjoyed this one here. For Kirk Herb Street, I'm Chris Fowler, and this has been another presentation of EA Sports College Football. Post game celebration. That's it. That's the post game celebration. I got to do better than that, man. I, in my opinion, that could have been a lot better. A lot better. I mean, there's a lot to be want. I don't know what the phrase is, but there's a lot that. I wanted to see. I mean, I want to see more team celebration. I mean, they took down a, a, a top ten opponent, right? Don't you want to see more excitement, more, uh, 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 more cutscenes, see what's going on? But again, it could be because it's play now, and that's why. And maybe in Dynasty we see more. But I mean, that a little bit of a disappointing post-game uh, scenes, cutscenes there. So I would like to see more there. But it was interesting, you know. I basically threw the pick on purpose, right? Because uh, I wanted to see what Texas and how they would celebrate. So I guess now I know, right? Next time I'll win. Uh, but let's see, right? You look at the stats. That's what I wanted to see, right? So you have the team stats. I like the soundtrack, by the way. We have more total offense by almost 100 yards, right? And then, you know, pretty standard rushes, yards, touchdown, and you just keep it going down. Pretty, pretty standard breakdown, nothing that we haven't seen. And then you go to the player stats, right? Look at 152.8 rating. I mean, he was just lighting it, lighting it up. I mean, we had two interceptions. Uh, and, then, you know, again, look, it goes all the way to punt return, so we didn't run it much. Or, uh, sorry, well, that's Texas a and Let's go to Bama, right? We only had. Uh, 12 carries. Yeah, 99 yards though, but that was most of that was from Simming. I didn't run him much. Milroy had 28. 
Uh, and passing wise, uh, two interceptions, I mean, that's just not, not, not good, right? And then receiving, let's see. I wonder if it shows both. No, it doesn't show both, right? It just shows uh, team by team, right? He had that uh, great touchdown, that big touchdown. And then you had the scoring summary, right? Quarter one, quarter two. I, I like the fonts that they use in this. It has a, it gives the game a very, very nice look. And if you look at the team logos up there, the banners, it has those wrinkles in it. I mean, shout out to the graphics team, man. They did a fantastic job with this. It looks really good, man. It looks really, really good. All right, so that pretty much wraps that up and then look you can also restart the game you don't have to go back into uh, the menu and then come back out again you can restart the game right there and then and also if anybody saw uh, this isn't this is not just an option at the end of the game if you're playing uh, mid game and you want to restart it you, sh you can restart it right there you don't have to go back into the main menu come back out into the loading screen load it all up you know what I mean you, don't, you can skip all that it just restarts the game right there for you so we'll, we'll go return to main, main, main menu right and it goes back right it's saving the profile right there unfortunately I lost my first game don't judge me uh, and then in the upcoming videos, uh, please you know stay tuned, tune in. Uh, I'll be going through Ultimate Team, Dynasty, uh, Road to Glory. Basically, this is a first impression series. Give everybody an overview of what the game looks like uh, and give them a feel, you know, how it plays. So far, I, I am impressed. I got, I look, I had very balanced expectations. I wasn't all the way up here, but I also wasn't super low with expectations I'm excited for the game right everybody is uh, I'm impressed I'm impressed I like it so far I mean just that was just play now I like the way it goes uh, I didn't see the wear and tear system I really wanted to see that so it looks like they don't show it in play now but that uh, and it's on it's definitely on the options on and you know when we go into dynasty we'll go uh, you know we'll see what it looks like you know we go into road to glory whatever mode it'll be we'll take a look at that and see how uh, much of an impact it is like you know if we throw it too much if we run it with the same running back over and over again I want to see if in fact it does make a big impact I'll have the dynasty first impression video I'll have the road to glory the ultimate team all that coming up for you so stay tuned I really hope you enjoyed please leave a like subscribe leave a comment you know tell me what you would like to see I would like I have like to have a series upcoming if you haven't seen the previous series I had a TCU series in NCAA 14, uh, so check that out if you like it. Uh, it's pretty standard, you know, just game to game, but I would like to start one in this and let me know what team you'd like to see. We'll have something called a handicap series, we'll have different tournament brackets, we'll have uh, all the conference alignments, you know, simming games, simming seasons, see, you know, having a lot of what ifs, whatever it may be, you know. Uh, I have a lot of that coming up, uh, so please subscribe and uh, stay tuned and thank you for tuning in.